My goal this week is to make simple meals that don't take long and that taste good. <laughs> so join me to see what we had for dinner this week. For the chicken cream cheese croissants, I sliced up some green onion and I chopped up or diced up some um, one jalapeno with the seeds removed. And then I took this already prepared chicken and cut it up into smaller chunks. I only used about half the container. And then I added eight ounces of cream cheese and a couple tablespoons of butter and like a fourth a cup of milk and mix that well and added salt and pepper. Next, you're gonna take your favorite refrigerated croissant dough and tear those apart, keeping two triangles together and you'll flatten the seam and, and add the filling into the middle. So once you get the filling in the middle, you'll pinch the sides together. But really you can be pretty creative with how you want to fold these up. I even did a few with just one of the, one of the triangles and rolled up some of the filling in the middle of those. So I did a little bit bigger ones, a little bit smaller ones. You just be creative. They all taste really good. <laughs> then I whitewashed or egg washed them and put them in the oven. These turn out so good, very flavorful, very tasty, yet super easy. You could have a salad with them or some vegetables on the side, but they make a really simple meal and I use them for leftovers for lunch the next couple days too. I think one of the keys to making really quick meals is to use a few shortcuts. Like this, I used already made breaded chicken tenders and a salad kit. Now, of course you can make your own salad if you would like, but I was just trying to save time. Some nights I just don't have a ton of time or energy, so I wanna make a quick meal that tastes good. My daughter kind of gave me a hard time. She's like, mom, why are you recording how to make a salad kit? <laughs> but I just thought there are other people out there who want to know how to make a yummy meal in a short amount of time. So here it is. I just took my salad, put it in a warmed tortilla, and I chopped up a chicken tender and put it in as well, added a little more Parmesan cheese and a little more um, Caesar dressing and then rolled it up and ate it just like that. Super, super simple, yet these were really, really good. So for this recipe, you're gonna take some melted butter and add some fresh parsley and garlic. And I decided I wanted to add just a little more butter. Then you'll take this um, garlic and butter mixture and you'll take your refrigerated pizza dough and stretch that out on your pan, however you like, whatever thickness you like. And then you're gonna coat the, um, the dough with this butter mixture and then start layering on your meat. I, I chose um, ham, salami, and pepperoni, and then I topped it with shredded mozzarella cheese. Then you're gonna roll this together and kind of pinch the edges and turn it over and coat the rest of it with the butter mixture. Go ahead and bake that and you have a delicious dinner ready in minutes. Then you'll slice it up and serve it with marinara or other um, sauces of your choice.
Just like the other recipes, I use these breaded frozen um, fish fillets to make it go a little faster. And then I make the sauce while we're waiting for those to cook with some sour cream, mayonnaise, milk, garlic powder, paprika, and a little cumin, and some salt and pepper. Then I squeezed half a lime or half a lime into the mixture and added my chopped cilantro. Mixed that up and it was a little thick, so I added a, another half of the lime. For the topping, I put some coleslaw mix in with chopped onions and chopped cilantro and more lime and salt. Mix that well and set it aside. Then you're gonna fry up your tortillas in a little bit of oil. When the fish fillets are done, you'll pull them out of the oven and you could chop them up. I didn't, I just stuck a couple pieces in there and added a little cheese and my coleslaw topping, cilantro, onion, and coleslaw topping, and my sauce. And it was delicious and amazing, and these meals were so tasty and so easy. I hope this helps, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.